Hi! We're doing a fun experiment about saliva and sugars and what effect they have on your teeth. We started out, here come over here, we started out taking a test of filtered water against the white. You can see that it's almost um, perfectly, and here's our tester. You can see it's almost perfectly neutral. Nope, in our middle. And we did saliva as well. And our saliva is pretty close to being green. This is old, it's drying out a little bit. And then we took that, and we, over here we have apple juice. In saliva we have straight apple juice right here, and apple juice in saliva. The apple juice in the saliva is pretty close. They're pretty close, but you can see that it's actually a little bit darker than the apple juice itself. So it has caused a little bit more acidity when you put it in with the saliva, and that was testing it after 20 minutes. And then we did some gummy bears. We put our gummy bears in water, and gummy bears aren't in and of themselves acidic like the apple juice was, but gummy bears, this is gummy bears in water. This, this yellow down here. This is gummy bears in water right there. You see that yellow? It's barely, barely showing up. This is gummy bears in saliva. And you can see, maybe you can see, you can see that the gummy bears in the saliva, see how, how bright that is? On our scale, that's a 6.0. Now we did this with a saliva. The saliva before we tested was this green. And we did it with the gummy bears. So obviously, and then if you take also, if you also take, so you've got your saliva, your gummy bear, and then gummy bears in water. You see the difference? Your saliva really, really reacts. You look at the scale, and you can see this is almost a six. Pretty close, and probably if it stayed in the saliva for longer, it would probably even react even more. And some things that a lot of people don't understand about uh, the scale of pH is that anything that the it's not just one number. When you go lower and lower, you're you're multiplying the times that it's more acidic by by tens. So from a seven to a six point five, or from a seven to a six even, is only a hundred times more acidic. But if from a six to a five is like a thousand times more acidic. So it's a big, big difference. And then we came over here and we did Doritos, which are so good for you. And there wasn't really this is Doritos in water. And then this was Doritos in saliva. And there wasn't really much of a difference. And so, Doritos are great for your teeth, eat them up. I'm just joking. Uh, and then we came over here with Listerine that is supposed to be so beneficial for your teeth. And you can see that it's actually quite acidic. It's at probably about a 6.3 or something. It's a little brighter than that. And uh, so, so Listerine is not good for your teeth. Don't use it unless you're going to rinse it right off. As soon as you use it, rinse it off with something else that's more alkaline, like some uh, alkaline water or something or something else. So anyway, 